he knows what Willis was talking about. He owns a rocket-firing Boba Fett. That's right, a rocket-firing Boba Fett. He has a black belt in verbal jiu-jitsu. Both Michael Jordan and LeBron James agree he's the GOAT. He once won the World Series of Poker despite holding only the get-out-of-jail-free Monopoly card and a green number four from the game Uno. When in Rome, they do as he does. He's a lover, not a fighter, but he's also a fighter, so don't get any ideas. If he were to punch you in the face, you would have to fight off the strong urge to thank him. He is the other son of jor -El. Roman Reigns acknowledges him. He is the franchise. The Ultimate Warrior pays him royalties for the use of his middle name. General Zod kneels before him. When it comes to narcissism, Donald Trump is merely the apprentice. He is the master. Sasquatch found him. In fact, he comes over to his house every Saturday night to watch the UFC. Once while having sex on a tractor trailer, part of his sperm got onto the engine. We now know this truck is Optimus Prime. He once was invited to a Lakers game to watch LeBron James play. That event was immediately canceled by security due to the fact that that level of awesomeness cannot be contained in one building. He is the franchise. Superman once fought him. The loser had to wear their underwear on the outside forever. When God said, let there be light, franchise said, say please. He's better than MJF, and MJF knows it. He can see John Cena. The only time he was ever wrong was when he thought he had made a mistake. He once punched a man in the soul. He does not use spell check. If he happens to misspell a word, Oxford will change the spelling. He is considered a national treasure in Uruguay, Italy, and Spain. They once named a street after him, but they had to change it because nobody would cross it. He is the franchise.